me get this straight. You lose your match when you're teaming with Phantom of the Opera to Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde, and you give him and your best friend whose ass I kicked a main event spot. You get to wrestle the Phantom of the Opera, and yet, for some reason, I come in, I win, I win, I win, I win, month after month, show after show, and yet, I don't get booked for the first Saturday night show for Smash Master. Are you dumb? Like, really? Really, Masty? You're not gonna book me? Okay. Don't book me. I'll be there, don't worry. I'll absolutely be at the show. But, I have my own business to attend to now. My name is Voodoo Man Cini, and I stand before you tonight embarrassed and disgusted by the sordid state of affairs here at Smash Master Wrestling. My directive for aggressive corporate restructure to finally bring some order to this godforsaken place. I found myself two consultants to assist me in establishing our think tank. And my first choice was an easy choice. My first choice was a smart choice. And his name is MIT, Mr. Intellectual Tavius. I can't believe it. Well, how can you not believe it? He said it was a smart choice, and this is the smartest one you can make. MIT, the smartest player in the game, joining Luca Mancini in what he just dubbed his think tank. It's the future of Smash Master Wrestling, but it's not just the future of Smash Master Wrestling. This is the future of 570 Wrestling, and we're taking over. And just so you people know, you're looking at two very fine looking gentlemen right here. But we got a third member to reveal. But you don't get to meet him until later on the night. Presenting Wild LLC. And a third member that is yet to be revealed. But Luca and MIT, two very impressive individuals here in Smash. And it's very telling, Luca Mancini's music playing, starting with that uh, with that carnival music, almost like like a little tongue-in-cheek reference that Luca Mancini seems to be a ringleader of sorts here in this in this uh, promotion. He's got some sort of plan. And their opponents. Perhaps we're about to see what he has. Standing on the stage, got the whole place rocking. It's popping, no stopping. Standing on the stage, got the whole place watching. Vacation, hotel hopping. They are Daniel Alexander Hollers and Jason. No colors, just bangers. No colors, just bangers. Daniel Alexander and Oliver, five years in the business, tagging together for three years out of the Monster Factory. I've called these guys plenty of times in Jersey. Tons of fun, high energy. Hashtag for the youth. And of course, just saying, trained at Skid Row, super crazy out of Jacksonville, Florida. So excited to have these three in Smash Master Wrestling. Yeah, I'm very interested to see what they can bring to the table here in Smash Master Wrestling. And they've got this crowd in truth hyped up. Well, I don't know if you're good, very good at math, but uh, there's something up here. Well, this is this is the high tension trio showcase match. And is Peter? Is this the third man? No way. With the think tank. What? Jason what are 
they have? What are they? What is Jason Furious thinking? MIT just got out of a, a, what, a four month feud with Jason Furious. Coming out on top, Jason Furious was, was, uh, was defeated uh, uh, in the end. Is, is that why you kind of saw the writing on the wall? Jason Furious, the victim of a few losses recently here in Smash Master. And is this a case of if you can't beat him, join him? I, I think so, but like, Jason Furious, the third member of the Think Tank. Now my question is, did Jason Furious come in here and he's willing to work with everybody, or did Luca Mancini come in with his business proposition and he's gonna have a problem being here with MIT? Well, Luca seems to be trying to direct traffic. You mentioned he seems like the ringleader. Can all of these egos coexist? And here we go, no colors, just bangers. Going right at the think tank. Trio's Dick. action. Oh man, Oliver just taking MIT out there. No colors, just bangers, of course, representing We Are One, which is what they call a wrestling vibe. Based in Philly, operating out of New Jersey. Holy smokes, look at it! Jason Furious off the top rope, corkscrewing to the floor. My God. Every time we call a match with, uh, with Jason Furious, we see just, uh, oh, wait a minute, just saying. Just saying up the top. Oh! Takes everyone out, clearing the field. But MIT and Luca Mancini back in the ring. What is this? Hold on a second. MIT! What? Oh! Good God! Into the crowd! Our Gold Circle ticket holders getting their money's worth here. Oh! Luca! What is going on right now, Jordan? This is craziness. Luca Mancini coming off with the with the the the, 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 the Harris on the outside. Hold on a second. Wait a minute. We're not done. Daniel Alexander coming off the ropes. Topeko Nile. Everyone's down. All right, I'm done. I'm 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 out. I'm out of gas already. That's it. Luca Mancini. Luca's out here doing a leapfrog. Luke, this is unbelievable. Look at this. At Kicks. this point in the match, these guys are still flipping around. Oh, oh my God. Kicks Luca Mancini into the wrong corner, coming in with a hot forearm. Oh. oh. Double boots to the face, calls, finds its mark. Calls that eat defeat. Luca kicks out at two. two. Almost eight defeat there. Two count only, and now the powerhouse of the, of the team. Oliver picking up his, his uh, partner and slamming him down onto Mancini. Furious breaking up the count. And I'm just realizing Furious and MIT wearing uh, semi-matching gear. That's, that's disturbing to me. Oliver now. Look at this. Again. Oliver's a maniac in there. Just picking people up and throwing them around. Fantastic tandem offense from no colors, just bangers. Just saying, in the ring. Into the corner now. Puts him back. Oh, up and over it goes Luca Mancini. Oh, to, thumb to the eye. Blocks one. Oh, but hangs him up on that top rope. Cross the throat, now Mancini in control, just saying in trouble. Racks him up on his shoulders. Oh! Down on his knee. Goes for the cover now. That was almost three there. Would have been a huge moment and a huge win for the Think Tank. I mean, I guess this is technically their debut in Smash Master Wrestling as a faction. Of course, Look at we've, that. We've seen all three in Smash Master before. Look at the quick tags. This is MIT and, and Jason Fury's working together right now. I don't know how to feel about it, Jordan. Now I've seen this side of Jason Furious before. That's right. But I thought he was past that. I thought he grew out of this phase. 
but apparently not. Every time we see Jason Furious have a, a moment of clarity and start to, to come to the right side and, uh, and be on the side of justice and, and what's right, he always ends up losing his way and backing up one step forward, three steps back, and going back to what he's known for, which is his dastardly approach. Well, just saying now, oh! trying to get an advantage, but eats a boot to the face from Jay Furious. Folks, that lag, Daniel Alexander in to, to break it up. Alexander, of course, the high flyer of the team. Uh, uh, Oliver, the powerhouse, but just saying, known as a tactician, the guy who uh, is able to pick his opponent apart. But right now, the think tank making that impossible for him to, to uh, pull out of his pocket. Well, if someone could pick their opponent apart, it's MIT. He's been known to do that. Picked up huge wins over guys like Jay Furious and Kit Raff. And, we'll and that's what led to his frustration here tonight and possibly joining Luca Mancini. And when we say MIT, that's not to be confused with DJ JT, who is the sponsor of the corresponding team, the uh, narration team tonight, myself, Jordan, Samira. Shout out DJ JT, thanks for the sponsorship. Now just saying, getting back up to the top. Oh, wait a minute. We've seen this before. MIT likes to trap his opponents in the corner like this. Oh my God. And look, he's got him. In the burning hammer position, dangerous! Oh! Sends him crashing to the mat. And a boot right to the midsection by Oliver. Makes the save. This match is still going. Just saying, doing his best to fight back. Trying to wear down MIT with those strikes. What a forearm by Just saying. He's so close. But now, MIT pulls him back in. Oh, oh, pull the old look at this. Outsmarting his opponent once again. MIT is very well known for that as much as I hate to admit it. And now Luca in calling shots. Big double suplex. Mancini now. Just saying, I don't know if you uh, follow him on social media. He's got this cool thing where he like says an opinion and he and he, uh, he has a, a cool sign off. Like he goes, he's like, uh, hey, I think uh, pineapple doesn't belong on pizza. I'm just saying. Pretty clever. I like it. I dig it. Whoa, whoa, catching that, catching that strike, turning him around. Oh! Dumping him down on his head, neck, and shoulders. Nailing him with the amazing slam. This and is his opportunity. Just saying has the chance now. He needs to make the tag to one of his fresh partners. Oliver's ready. Daniel Alexander's ready. Luca Mancini in a bad way. Crawling over to his corner as well. Just saying over there. Who's gonna make the tag first? Alexander comes in. And here comes Furious, takes the clothesline. Oh, goes to the midsection. It's Furious, wait, ducks the clothesline. Both roll through. Oh, oh, what a right hand. Explosive offense by Daniel Alexander. Mr. 1-800 bangers. Oh, spear by, oh my God. Oliver taking down MIT. And look at this. Oh, taste of greatness. Wait a minute, hold on a second. Scaling to the top rope, tag made. Keep your eyes to the skies. Jay no. Furious able to roll out of the way. Wait a minute, Luca Mancini just pulled him out, just saying in there. Rolling on the outside. Oh, what a shot by just saying. Goes for the cover now. Not the legal man. Oh! And a pump kick to the face. Just saying in enemy territory here. At the mercy of the think tank. Look at, look at the teamwork from these guys. All three of them working in unison. I've never seen anything like this. Oh! Mid-scene dropping him face first into the canvas, and that's it. The collaboration of the think tank picks up the win. Successful in their debut as a faction. And this is, I don't know, man. I don't know how to feel about this. They're embracing in the ring. I mean, 
picking up a victory. The talent level of these three is something that everyone at Smash Master Wrestling should be concerned with. Luca Mancini may have made the best business decision of his Smash Master Wrestling career in getting himself and these two individuals together. And you know Ethan Wilde is going to be very happy with the outcome of this match. Luca Mancini proving his worth and picking up two huge acquisitions for Wild LLC in MIT and Jason Furious. Folks, don't go anywhere. Main event still to come. Jay Bougie, Kate Raff, submission match coming up next. Smash Master Wrestling, Pennsylvania Wild. I'm Sabrina. I'm joined by the Think Tank. Luca and the Think Tank, this is your first match here tonight as a team. You've made your debut. Tell me, how are you feeling? Samira, business is booming, and it has only just begun. Myself, Jason Furious, MIT, we are the Think Tank, and we're here to upend everything that has been established to Smash Master Wrestling, because quite frankly, business here has not been working. And we are taking our spots, we are demanding that we get the respect that we have earned and that we deserve. And whether we have to run through that three misfits we went through tonight, or Kit Raff, Massey, and Adina Steele themselves, we're gonna take every opportunity to make them know who we are. 